Governor Mark Dayton plans to meet with officials on the Iron Range just weeks after he dealt a blow to a proposed copper nickel precious metals mine near the Boundary Waters Canoe Area Wilderness. The Mosabi Daily News reports Dayton will meet Friday with Ely officials and with the Range Association of Municipalities and Schools. Earlier this month, Dayton said the state wouldn't authorize access to its lands for the proposed $2.8 billion Twin Metals Minnesota, southeast of Ely, citing its proximity to the Boundary Waters in its decision. Environmental groups praised the move, but officials on the range have voiced opposition. Ely Mayor Chuck Novak says he hopes to change Dayton's mind. Twin Metals has already spent about $400 million on the project, which would create about 850 full-time jobs. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.